Get ready to match the stars. Bill Daly. Brett Summers. Jack Carter. Judy Carr. Richard Dawson. And Fanny Flay. As we play the star-studded big money match game 73. And now here's the host of match game 73. Thank you very much for your when kind your applause. Has. I wore this for the lady May who I... said I dressed too conservatively. <laughs> yes. May I ask you a have question. a question, sir? How long have you been working for Greyhound? <laughs> You, why are you all dolled up? Well, I'm going to a formal. Uh, uh, Brett and I are running away from Klugman. Oh. And... I'll tell you how wild it is. I'm going to the same formal. <laughs> this, party, is, right? this is a rental, incidentally. Oh, you got to get it. I got it from a guy that rents them for weddings and funerals. Except every time I hang it up, the arms go this way. <laughs> Okay, we've got all that up. out of our systems now. Let's welcome our champion here is Claudia Ace. Hi, Claudia. Hello. How are you? Fine, thank you. Good. Claudia's got $600. $600 is what she has. She's uh, won uh, two games, right? One no, game. just one game. Oh, just one game. I mean, yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, that's right. You want $100 no, you're for the game, acting like a $500 for the audience match, and now you're going to have a go at $5,000 in the second half of the super match there. And we'll do that, Claudia, right after we uh, hear these messages. Yay. Claudia Ace here is ready to have a go at $5,000, aren't you? Yes, I am. Okay, you won the $500, and you'll be playing for 10 times that amount, or the $5,000 now. To win that money, you've got to match one celebrity on a head-to-head -head basis. It has to be exact, and it's time to choose one now. Bill. Bill. Bill who? Oh, Bill. Bill, Bill knows. There Bill he is. No. Bill knows. Bill knows. No. Yes. <laughs> Bill knows. <laughs> Bill gets stuck. He says nose to anything. Wife says, "How was your day?" Nose. Just something he does with nose. <laughs> okay. Now you get ready to write, Bill, and okay. you face me if you would, please, Claudia. Here is the five thousand dollar question. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Ten blank. Ten T E N blank. It's a career. Okay, Bill is finished. Now, Claudia, we need your response. How do you fill in that blank? Ten... Little Indians. Ten Little Indians? Do you think that's a winner, audience? All right, Bill, for $5,000, may we see your response, please? $5,000 <laughs> and ten Little Indians. Ten! Congratulations, my dear. Well done. Well done. Bad luck. Oh, boy. Well, you've uh, won the whole ball game here. You have won the absolute maximum one can win in one game, which is $5,600. And you're still the champ. You're going to meet another player and play another game. Are you ready for that? Uh, yeah. You are? Yeah. Nice, Claudia. You're a pretty cool cat, aren't you? No. <laughs> Gene, two for two, Gene. That's two for two for Bill. Very well done, Bill. All right, here comes Olivia Linky. Hi, Olivia. <laughs> Olivia, you know Claudia? How are you? Just fine, thank you. Good. Where are you from and all that? I'm from Claremont. I am a dental receptionist, and I have two lovely children. I got this tooth here. That I have. <laughs> all right, good luck, Olivia. You know how the game plays? You know what happens when I push this button? Bing, the thing goes down and reveals two questions, and you as a challenger will make the selection. A, please. She wants A. All right. Bernice said, 
My son, the explorer, has been at the South Pole too long. I just found out he's been blanking penguins. <laughs> <laughs> Use that at your benefit later. That's the Bernice worst. Says, My son, the explorer, has been at the South Pole too long. I just found out he's been blanking penguins. <laughs> the lower tier is ready, upper tier. The upper tier is ready. You're ready. My tier is ready. Straight nose juice. <laughs> I thought it was water too. It's wow. It's water. Okay. The All it's right, like you're ready, right? Oh. Here we go. It is water. Olivia. Bernie said, My son, the explorer, has been at the South Pole too long. I just found out he's been blanking penguins. Kissing. Kissing penguins. He says kissing penguins. Oh, that's not a bad That's story. nice. Bill, what did you say? Well, this is my day, man. I'm kissing penguins. Kissing too. penguins. You ever kiss a penguin? Yeah. Nice. Cold kissers. Very cold kissers. They're cold kissers. Okay. Brett, what did you say? But smooth. But smooth. <laughs> <laughs> Are you making whoopee? That's like kissing. Uh, cold. Yeah. Making whoopee with penguins. Okay. Don't well, look yeah. me no. like that. I'm kidding. There he is. There's a penguin suit there, Jack. What do they mean? You got your well, it, it was my son, the explorer. A nice Jewish boy goes to the North Pole, puts a little chicken fat in a penguin, and he, and he, and he, and, 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 and he okay. eats one. He was he eating eats, a penguin. He, eating a penguin. Yeah, okay. he had it uh, breaded. Kissing is her answer. What's yours, Judy? <laughs> um, kissing and necking and dating. Dating a penguin. No match there. And Richard? Well, that's exactly it. Uh, ah. Penguin number three is married and lives at Malibu. <laughs> What do you say? I want to hear a funny buzzer. Dating. Dating. Dating was the answer there, according to the celebrities. All of you, you scored once there. And now, Claudia, we've got this for you. The Maharaja uh -huh. believes in going first class. Uh -huh. He has the only elephant in the world with a blank. Uh -huh. The Maharaja believes in going first class. He has the only elephant in the world with a blank. This Maharaja is not to be believed. You believe him. I believe him. You believe him. In your house, you can take it. Hey, I believe you. My elephant can run faster than your elephant. Well, that's easy for you to say. It's very easy for me to say. Thank you. Because I am a rich Maharaja. Maharani. Okay, now we're ready. And Claudia, we call on you. He has the only elephant in the world with a... Gold trunk. Gold trunk. Yeah. You've been sitting here all this time and you've yeah. thought of gold trunk? Yeah. <laughs> had no five minutes to no figure out an answer. Claudia. you got gold trunk. All right, Bill, gold trunk is an answer. If you, you think, think she's bad, wait to see what I got, oh, right? Oh, really bad. Alligator luggage. <laughs> you know, gold trunk and alligator, well, luggage, they're both luggage. You sure you can't match that just because they're so crazy that, no, I guess you can't do that. All right, Brett. How many did you say you won and got and you're doing all that bragging earlier on? Forget it. You just blew it. Uh, it was the bathroom in his seat. Bathroom in his seat. Okay, that's her answer, and she's stuck with it. Jack, There's what do you say? somebody out there who appreciates it. Right. <laughs> the bathroom attendant. Yeah, Jack. Gold trunk no. is... I forgot what I wrote. <laughs> Depends no longer. What's the question again? The oh, Maharaja the rich elephant with yeah. the Maharaja? Yeah. I came up with nothing. An elephant had power steering. <laughs> I had trouble breathing, too. <laughs> my, okay, Judy. It's very funny. <laughs> my elephant has a no smoking section. A no smoking section? There. That's a big elephant, isn't the it? The only elephant in the world that had a water bed. <laughs> a water bed, there. Oh. Thank you. Oh, well, but my elephant will run faster than your elephant there. What do you say there, Fanny? I could kill myself. I started to write gold trunk. And <laughs> I put to bedroom and private bath. <laughs> that is a large elephant. All right, ladies, at the end of round one, the score is one to nothing in favor of the challenger. And we'll go to round two right after we go to this message for you.
Now well, let's go on with match game 73. Go to round two of this game in which the challengers are ahead one to nothing. And you make another selection, if you would, please. A again. Olivia wants A again, and this time, Bill, you will not play. Everyone else will. What did I do wrong? <laughs> <laughs> you did something right for a oh, change. I know it's out. Oh, I know it's Harriet, <laughs> <laughs> Harriet was shocked. Harry was shocked? When she opened the blank and found her husband inside. Harriet? Harriet was shocked when she opened the blank and found her husband inside. Oh, when she opened the blank? Oh. Yeah, open the blank. You see, the blank is the word you fill in. Uh, how many weeks have been here, Brett? Uh, 30. <laughs> okay. All uh, right, now we're all set. And Olivia, we call on you. Harriet was shocked when she opened the blank and found her husband inside. What did she open? The closet. The closet. She Woo! says the closet. All right. Brett, she says the closet. See, you thought I was kidding when I said I was depressed. Coffin. The coffin. <laughs> oh, dear me. Closet is the answer, Jack, we're looking for. What have you got? Well, she opened, uh, she found him hiding in a shower curtain. Nude. And he said he was a nudist and he was voting. <laughs> <laughs> she opened the bathroom door. I see. Thought. Hiding nice. inside there. Judy Carr. Well, I've got a closet. A closet. There you go. There's one match for you. How about you, Richard? In that case, you're a queen. Yes. I have a closet. There is a closet. No photographs, please. <laughs> and Fanny Flagg, who looks I've, pensive. I've had the flu for about a week. You've had the flu yeah. for about a week. I put icebox. <laughs> icebox. Well, that'll give you the flu if you start hiding in iceboxes. I tell you. All right. Now, it's three to nothing, and you must score three matches to stay in the running. Four will win the game for you. Everyone will participate in this. Okay. Well, what's that? I'm sorry. What did you say? Everyone will play, Billy Boy. Hilda said to Glenn, when you meet my mother, please don't make any jokes about her strange blank. <laughs> Hilda said that to Glenn. When you meet my mother, please don't make any jokes about her strange blank. Already over there? Okay. Claudia, Hilda said to Glenn, when you meet my mother, please don't make any jokes about her strange... Nose. No. <laughs> That's been his answer all... Oh, the about, one time I didn't do it. For about three or four oh. days, that's been his favorite I had answer. No matter what you ask, cards you say said nose. nose. This is the one that doesn't say nose. No nose? Oh, daughter I put. Oh, daughter. Brad. Oh. Oh, I'm so sorry, she's okay. up at the nose. <laughs> All right, oh. nose, Brett. You didn't, are you sure you didn't say nose? No, I said daughter. Yeah. Size. Size. No match there, Jack. I knew Bill would goof. Yeah. Looking over and seeing him breathing heavy, I saved Claudia with her mother's nose. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Hilda said to Glenn, when you meet my mother, please don't make any jokes about her strange blank. What do you I said, say? not nose, but looks. Strange looks. Now, you must match the two remaining celebrities to achieve a tie. Richard. I was going to put gold trunk. <laughs> I put hairdo. Hairdo! So, Olivia is the winner. Congratulations. Can you come down, please? We got $100 for you, and if you'll stand by for a moment, we'll say goodbye to Claudia. She'll be leaving here with $5,600. That makes you happy. Yeah. Thank you, Claudia. Goodbye. Goodbye. We'll get to you and tell you what happens next right after this message. Now, Olivia Lenke here has won her game. Uh, she's got $100. She's going to have a go at over $5,000 now. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. We polled a recent studio audience, Olivia, and we got their best response to this. Secret blank. The answer they gave most often is worth $500 if you can match it. Second most frequent response, $250. And the third, $100. Now, which three celebrities would you like to get a little assist from? Bill. Uh, Secret Service. Secret Service is his answer. That's a good Brett. answer. Brett. Brett, what do you say? Secret agent. Secret agent. And Richard. And Richard. Oh, 
one of my great shows, Secret Storm. The butler did it. That follows us, doesn't it? It's well, on most of these stations. Following. Yes, okay. So you've got Secret Service, Secret Agent, and Secret Storm. You may choose one of those or give us one of your own. What would you like to do? Secret Storm. Secret Storm. You think, you, you think, I think you've influenced her. Have they influenced you? No. They haven't. That's your honest choice. All right, Secret Storm is the one she's looking for. Let's find out where it is, if it's up there at all. First, the $100 response. Secret Love is a good answer that none of us thought about. Okay, Secret Storm, let's see if it's under the $250 response. Secret Agent is the one that Brett gave you. Third and last chance for Secret Storm, Olivia. The audience is hoping that it's there, as we all are, too. Here is a $500 response. Secret yeah! Storm. Okay, so you've got the $500, and now you're going to have a go at 10 times that amount or $5,000. Uh, to collect, you've got to match one of those celebrities. Has to be exact. Which one will it be? Has to be Richard. Richard, you get ready to write, and you face me, Olivia. Here's the $5,000 question. Mm -hmm. Write your answer to this, if you would, please. Blank oil. O-I-L. Blank oil. Okay, he's finished. Now, would you fill in that blank in a way you think will match Richard Dawson? Blank oil. Baby. Baby oil. Okay. <laughs> All right, Richard, for $5,000, may we see your answer, if you please? It's what I feel like drinking. I said bath oil. Bath oil. All right, there were two good answers, bath oil and baby oil. What would you have said, olive oil or something like that? Olive oil, yeah, that would have been good too. You've got $600, Olivia. You're going to play another game, so let's meet your new opponent. Here comes Jan Crone. I'm sorry. Hello there. You want to step up there now? You know Olivia, Jan? Uh -huh. How are you, Jan? Just fine, thank you. Could you tell us a little bit about yourself? I'm from San Diego, and I'm a substitute school teacher, and I also work part-time in a restaurant. Yeah, part-time what? In a restaurant. Oh, all right. Okay, good luck to you here. I'll push the button and ask you, the challenger, to make a selection. B, please. Jan wants B. Everybody plays. Brand new game. <clears throat> Charlie, the crazy taxidermist, went on a rampage and started stuffing everything he could get his hands on, even Mildred's blank. <laughs> Okay. That's all in your head, right? I think she's sitting on my <laughs> sleeves. Okay, we're about set. Are we, Jack? Yeah. All right. Now, Jan, how would you handle this? Charlie the crazy taxidermist went on a rampage and started stuffing everything you could get his hands on, even Mildred's blank. Cat. Her cat. Oh. I didn't know Mildred had a cat. But well, we'll find out right now. What do you say, Bill? Well, I gotta stay with this till I get a winner. Stuffing her uh -huh. nose. Now that makes sense. Come on. You have a nose stuff job? What's up with that? No, no match there. Cat's the answer, Brett. Okay. I said wig. Uh -huh. Wig. Okay. Stuffer, uh, what do you say? Uh, the cat was nice and fat. Mildred needed a little in the upstairs department because what nature had forgotten you stuff with cotton, he stuffed her brassiere. Uh -huh. All right. Judy? I said stuffed her mother. Stuffed her mother? Oh, that's a lovely thought, isn't yes, it? Yes, isn't it? Yeah. It's okay. different in England. <laughs> it's Elliot. Oh, I must get a room. <laughs> uh, yes, he stuffed her parakeet her into parakeet. her cat. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you love show people? Okay. <laughs> Fanny. Judy Karn saying mother. Isn't that the worst thing? I said mother. My mother's always tired. You're kidding. Uh, yes, my, she said I thought mother my too. mother's always wanted to be stuffed. She really? said, when I go, don't put me in the ground. Any of those things, I want to be stuffed. Yeah. yeah. Oh. I don't want to hear any more about oh. that. 
Okay, so you've got to go to your end of round one, but first we've got to go to this, and then we'll get back to the ladies. Now, this is uh, all the time we have, I'm sorry to say. We'll pick up at this point right in the middle of round one next time we get together. Look forward to seeing you next time, ladies. And I want to thank all of our celebrated celebrities here for her, their terrific efforts. You were just splendid. Thank you very much. And I hope to see all of you again very soon. Some of you I know I'll see, and some of you I won't see. Them. <laughs> Listen, I hope... Uh, name, name. I'll you'll you. <laughs> I hope you'll join us next time when we'll have these celebrities. Ipsy Russell, Fred Summers, Charles Nelson Raleigh, Beverly Garland, Richard Dawson, and Betty White. Team Rayburn here saying join us next time for Match Game 73. Bye. How could we possibly make lingo better? More money. We're getting real serious with this thing. It's the new bonus round progressive jackpot. Get a lingo on your first pull and win $12,000, $19,000, $28,000. Or more. Each show, Chuck will add $1,000 until someone takes the whole jackpot home. How high will it go? Man, it's Woo! a lot of money, I'm telling you. Find out on the new season of lingo. Tonight at 7.30 on GSN. The network for games.